All About Football TV. I'm Charlene Smith and I'm joined by Sam, Sam. an Arsenal fan. Now, Sam, we're playing, we're playing West Ham at home on Saturday. What are you expecting from the game? Um, like 2 0, 3 0, minimum. To us? Yeah, of course. West Ham are not doing very good at the moment. And like last week's performance against Fulham was, was out of this world, isn't it? and I'm expecting big things from Arteta. So I'm actually excited. <laughs> um, with West Ham as well, I mean, they haven't been on the greatest form. They lost 2 0 to Newcastle as well. Yeah. Um, what do you think they're going to come with? Not a lot. I don't really see them going going anywhere this season. To I think they're going to get relegated. I feel like we're going to walk through them. I don't know if I'm you... being a bit too confident, <laughs> but I genuinely believe that we're going to walk through them. But that's just, that's just me. Yeah. yeah, I mean, there is talks about Declan Rice possibly going uh, to Chelsea. Well, they're making a bid for him. Yeah. What do you think that would do to West Ham? Um, I don't really rate him that highly. Declan you don't? Rice. I think he's all right. Like, even when you watch him play for England, he doesn't really do much. He just goes sideways, backwards. Be all right. Like, I mean, I would have signed him if I was Chelsea. They already got Kante, Jorginho, Kovacic. They don't need him. Mm. But, yeah. And with our game against Fulham last week, I mean, great result for us. Uh, how would you sort of describe our performance? Oh, it was so good. It was amazing. Like the fact that Gabriel scored. He played so good. Aubameyang scored. Lacazette scored. Like I'm, I'm just excited that Lacazette scored because I like Lacazette. <laughs> and yeah, it was a good still. There's been talks about Lacazette possibly uh, leaving nah, as well. Nah, Do you nah, think nah, that's nah, going to nah, happen? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> You're not going anywhere. <laughs> not on my watch. <laughs> <laughs> so the signing finally got announced. Aubameyang signing a three-year contract. How excited was you about that? Buzz. Buzz, like he's so people are just like coming up to me saying he's 31 years old why are you so excited but like he doesn't play like he's 31 do you know what I'm saying he actually bagged goals and like I'm actually excited and I feel like that's gonna make other players want to come so hopefully we get another signing on top of on top of that signing and what other players would you like to see come into the club I would rather party over a war personally party party <laughs> Partey, it's time for a party. <laughs> Why do you prefer Partey? Tell me, what is it about him? Like, we've been missing that CDM, that holding player for a very long time. And I feel like he would actually make a difference to our team. Like, I rate Shaka, I don't think Shaka's bad, but I feel like we've been missing that, like, that Vieira type of player for a very long time. I feel like he will actually shore up our defence from, like, playing CDM. But, yeah. So if we do get Partey, I mean, we've got Aubameyang, he's signed now. Yeah. Gabriel's looking really good at the yeah. back. Where do you think we'll finish this season? We'll push top four. Top four, yeah? Five to four, hopefully, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully. He's saying three over there, he's saying three. Three, finish third, yeah? <laughs> All right, well, so you're expecting what? A two new win against West Ham? Yeah. Who are you expecting to see on that score sheet? Aubameyang. Aubameyang. Hopefully a hat-trick for Aubameyang. Oh, 2-0 or 3-0? What are you going for? 3-0. 3-0, hat-trick. Is that because he's made the signing now? He's on fire. He's going to come, give it everything. I know, we always beat West Ham as well, most of the time. I don't, I don't really rate them. I hope Pepe starts, though. I want to see him start. I want to see Willian in the middle, like playing Cam, and Pepe on the right side. What did you think of Willian's performance as well? He I mean, that was his debut. He really good. I feel like a lot of people were hating on him. Like, I still rate him, like, highly. He had a very, really good performance, actually. But, yeah, no, I mean, I'm excited for Willian as well. I'm excited. And I'm Martinez is now. Oh, sorry, what was you going to say? I'm just excited. In general, with <laughs> Show me your excitement. Me. You know what I'm saying? Literally, I was speaking to like a United fan. They don't, they don't seem that excited about their season. Like, I'm actually excited. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, Martinez. Yeah, Martinez, he's gone to Aston Villa. I mean, first of all, what was your preference? Leno or Martinez? This has been like an ongoing debate. Um, I like Martinez because he's, he's like, he's Arsenal through and through. But. Leno is a better keeper. He's, I feel like Leno is like just just below world class. That's like my personal opinion anyway. And like I understand why he had to leave. And I watched that video, that video that he released, that was so sad. Like I know, so that. touching. Yeah, and I was actually so sad. I was like all oh, my days, but no, nah, I think Leno, I prefer Leno. Yeah. yeah. And and you're predicting another clean sheet from Leno as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're looking at golden glove for Leno this season, perhaps. <laughs> No, not, not pushing yet. it that far. Right, so there we have it. Sam's score prediction for Arsenal v West Ham is 3 0. I like that score prediction. I'm happy with that. I'm looking at probably around the same thing as well. Yeah. I'm Charlene Smith. Thanks for watching this video. If you've liked it, give us a like and don't forget to subscribe.